Hello and welcome to Trust TV News Summary. I am Ibrahim Yusuf. The News in Brief. President Mohamed Buhari has welcomed the choice of ex borno State Governor Kashim Shetima as running mate to the APC candidate Bola Chinubu. Buhari, according to a statement by presidential spokesman Gerbo Shehu, expressed optimism that the APC ticket will emerge victorious in 2023. In his remarks, Senator Kashim Shetim expressed appreciation to the president for his support and pledged to remain loyal and devoted to the president and the party. The Senate on Wednesday passed the Electricity Bill 2022. The bill's passage was sequel to the consideration of a report by the Senate Committee on Power. The chairman of the committee, Gabriel Suswam, in his presentation said the bill seeks to, among others, provide an ideal legal and institutional framework to leverage on the modest gains of the privatization phase of the power sector in Nigeria. The Nigerian Civil Aviation Authority, NCAA, on Wednesday suspended the air transport license and air operation, operator license of Dana Airlines indefinitely. The NCAA Director General, Musa Nuhu, who announced this in a statement Wednesday night, said the decision is the outcome of a financial and economic health audit carried out on the airline by the regulatory authority. And finally, natural gas has started flowing through the Nord Stream 1 pipeline from Russia to Germany after a 10-day shutdown for maintenance. But the gas flow is expected to fall well short of full capacity amid German fears that the Kremlin is using energy as a weapon of war. Russia is prioritizing the capture of critical national infrastructure, such as power plants in Ukraine. And that wraps our Trust TV news summary for this hour. For more news, you can subscribe and follow us across all our social media platforms. I am Ibrahim Yusuf. Thanks for watching.